these are Mansa Trade Training Institute students exhibiting how they are made to use charcoal due to the power supply problem being faced at the institution. The students last week decided to march to town center as they protested over the erratic power supply that has characterized the institution. They demanded that ZESCO change their power line from the national grid to Musonda Falls where there is less unnecessary interruption. We have tried to follow the protocol, mm. the procedure. We, we visited ZESCO first. Fr from ZESCO, we went to the PS. Then the PS advised us and the, the ZESCO manager said, we are going to come to address the students. But uh, since then, no one came. When was that? Instead of they have seen that we have that electric supply of power, instead of the institute is starting helping us in those areas, but they are just sitting there dormant and looking for us, doing for, uh, looking after ourselves over those things. Eh? Uh, and, uh, and for over that, we didn't budget for that. Even our parents didn't know about all these, pro these problems. However, their problem could not be sorted out within the three days ultimatum, which was given to Sesco, hence leading to the closure of the school. This workshop has been closed for close to a month now, as it cannot operate without power, making it impossible for the students to carry out their practicals as well. The students have also complained over the state of the infrastructure, stating that it has not received any rehabilitation, despite having been dilapidated for a number of years now. They further said due to its dilapidated state, sanitation has proved to be a huge challenge at the institution. For now, the school shall remain closed 